Frightening moments at the bus stop after a little girl is hit by a semi truck. Fortunately, she's expected to be OK. Well, News Channel 5's Chris Conti went to Marshall County where he found weather may have played a role in this. Very dangerous road, very dangerous. Not a day goes by in the small town of Belfast. Uh-huh, just a couple of houses down there. The ginger wheat doesn't worry about the traffic on Highway 431. It's just a busy road, especially that time in the morning. Everybody getting to work. This morning around 7 o'clock, though, her fears became founded. They could hear the little girl screaming. Marshall County 911, where's your emergency? Uh, Denville Highway. 911 calls revealed the frantic moments this morning, just seconds after a six-year-old girl had been hit by a semi-truck as she tried to get onto her school bus. Uh, a child who was heading toward the bus just ran into an 18-wheeler. I was praying that it wasn't the school bus. That's all I could think of because it was right at that time and it was right there and I just was praying it wasn't the school bus, but it was. Tennessee Highway Patrol is still trying to determine what happened, but Ginger believes the thick fog that blanketed Marshall County this morning likely didn't help. It was really, really bad fog, but you know, the bus, they have all those bells and whistles and lights and I don't know. First responders had wanted to life flight the little girl to Nashville, but because the fog was so thick this morning, they had to take her in an ambulance. They could make school later when it's that foggy. Maybe something, I don't know. As for the little girl, she is expected to be okay. I hope she has speedy recovery. The week before Thanksgiving in the small town of Belfast, they have plenty here they're already thankful for. We got lots to be thankful for. Chris Conti, News Channel 5. Tennessee Highway Patrol is still investigating the crash tonight. No word on whether the truck driver will be cited.